I'm reinstalling everything. The thing is like uh, I reset my computer to factory default, so I need to start putting everything back. This time I'm gonna do the Waves plugins. And for that, we gotta go to waves.com, login, and then on the search bar, we're gonna type Waves Central and hit OK. So once we click on OK, it's gonna be the first link and then we're gonna click on it. And right here, you either download for Mac or Windows. So I have Mac, so I'm gonna download for Mac. Once it's downloaded, we're gonna open the program. We're gonna drag it into the application folder. We open the application folder, and then we find the Waves icon and double click on it. And then we're gonna go to the usual procedure, hitting OK on Waves Central now. We're gonna enter our password and click Install Helper. And then we're gonna click where it says ISEC ULA and then I agree. And then click OK again. Now on this window, it's gonna take you to the website, but since I'm already logged in, it's gonna take me back to the Waste Central's application. So let's just click on open Waste Central and then it's gonna start syncing basically all the plugins. And then here they are. Once it's open, it's gonna ask you to see if you wanna get the new versions of plugins. In this case, it's version 14. I don't really want it because it's gonna cost me $200, even though um, I have version 13 and I'm up to the end of November, but I don't know why. So let's close this window for now. And where it says install products, I am just gonna select where it says my products. And then just double check, make sure everything is there or kind of close to it. And then we're gonna click on the blue button on the right side where it says install and activate. Notice that there is a tab next to my product which is all products. Uh, in this tab, you can find basically all the plugins by Wave. You can download as many as you want, give it a try for a few days or a week I think, and decide for yourself whether or not you wanna keep it. This is a good way to test them out. This process might take a little while, probably 15 to 20 minutes uh, until it's done. Okay, so I speed it up for the video purposes and it's done. All you gotta do is just click OK and then all your plugins are already installed. Let's click on the license tab and then connect to devices and mine is AOS Studios and as you can see I had 26 activated. And that's pretty much it. All you gotta do now is just to open your favorite dot and double check, make sure the that your plugins are activated. All right, guys, thanks for watching. That's all for me. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, put a thumbs up, leave a comment if you have any question, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.